Tri Center Community Schools is located in southwest Iowa, 20 miles from the metropolitan area of Council Bluffs, Omaha. We have approximately 800 students, pre K through 12. We're sitting in the middle of corn and beans. We have a lot of farmland, obviously, and, and, and a number of farmers that are around. Some of these kids don't necessarily see what um, the big cities are like. They might come from families where their parents really don't know how to use the computers. I think speed is, is paramount to everything, and I say that because what we are able to give our kids and what our kids need, there's always a gap. There's not always enough money and you have to, you only get so much. You know, when you're trying to trend, when you forecast, well, what if I've got this much money, really where's my the biggest bang for my buck? When we got Multiport Server, this is gonna sound funny, but I almost went through the ceiling with my big hurrah. <laughs> it is something I've been asking for since I've been here. I was constantly having to walk through the classroom and see what they were on. Kids are going to be kids. They're going to want to see what they can get away with. Multipoint allows the teacher to have absolute control of the desktop and to be able to monitor the things that are going on and make sure students are on task. Windows Multipoint Server has made it easier for the teachers that use it, I would have to say. It makes it easier for them to monitor what the um, students are doing at any point in time. It was a clean install. It was really easy to work with. We have it installed on two physical servers and we have four instances of multi-point server running virtually on a Microsoft Hyper-V storage failover cluster. It was pretty basic. Pop the DVD in and uh, do the install. Uh, just a couple things you had to configure, but for the most part it was a very easy install. One of the coolest things for me was being able to show teachers the management application and showing them how they can you know, manage the websites that are available. It does have um, the ability to limit access to various websites. Students a lot of times will say that um, this isn't fair, this is invading my privacy. They'll, they'll be looking at something just staring at the screen all of a sudden and be like, hey, give that back like, because she took the internet away or blocked him or something. So it's kind of funny. One of the other things that we're able to do with Multipoint is we can extend the life of technology for the school. And so they're not having to refresh as quickly as they would have to if they were using those devices as an endpoint on their own. Windows Multipoint Server 2011 enabled us to do just that, to build upon on our environment, make our instruction more productive, and yet allow us to do things within the confines of, of, of good fiscal operation. There are much greater costs that have nothing to do with money. You know, and to me, the greatest cost is not, not giving your kids accessibility and mobility. What's the price tag on that? It's exciting to be able to deliver quality solutions at a lower cost than we've been able to do before, and that's one of the beauties of Multipoint. Without that, it could be a nightmare for some of these, these teachers to keep their kids on task and making sure that they're helping them in the way they need to be helping them.